What is up everybody and welcome to part 4 of SummerSlam where we start off with the Women's Undisputed Championship match. And coming out first, cashing in her briefcase, is Ember Moon. Yeah, it's a risky proposition cashing in in a triple threat match. Of course it could have been one on one but uh, Dakota Kai decided to use her rematch clause making it a triple threat. It's a risky proposition by uh, Ember Moon here tonight. I believe she could probably pull it off though if she tries she enough. She wanted to send a message to the women's division that she's confident enough to be able to pre-cash in and still get the victory. But that confidence got knocked heavily when Nia Jax defeated her in a warm-up for SummerSlam. And with some ease, I might say. Yeah, she made it. Uh, she did make it look incredibly easy. Ember Moon definitely knocked down a notch or two with that loss. Can uh, Dakota or Candice use that to their advantage, especially in the mind game department or the mental game, I should say. You've got to say as well that Nia Jax is probably the number one contender following SummerSlam after what she did to the Miss Money in the Bank. You've definitely got to imagine that is the case, which is not fun if you can this, who's just freshly won the championship at the last pay-per-view. No Johnny. Have to get in. No Johnny. He is not here tonight. He cannot be. It's a triple threat match. The referee said he is not allowed at ringside. I'm sure she brings him though in spirit. So, Johnny Gargano, not at ringside for once with Candice, which probably rules her out. Dakota, we can rule her out anyway. Useless, useless champion as Ember Moon. I don't know if she's useless. And Ember Moon will just go along nicely here and get the championship. We're done. No point even having the match. See? There we go. Told you. Oh, my God. This double team. Doesn't last long, though, with Ember. Uh, Ember doesn't team up with anybody. Oh, she was not. Army. God. I thought she was going to stomp her head, she hit the arm. Candice checking around then, maybe she was looking for Johnny Gargano. See if, oh Christ, what's what the hell? Jesus, she's ended up near the announce tables. Oh, good God, oh, oh my oh, God. Sneaky roll up, sneaky roll up. could defeat Ember oh. tonight. Oh my God. Whoa, oh, Jesus. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was almost close. Cheater. How's she cheating? Rolling up like we? that in a triple threat. Well, he's not cheating. This it's frowned up on, but it's not cheating. This Beckable spine buster. There you go. That's what you get. I wonder if that was a uh, plan from Johnny, the roll up. Yeah, mate. It sounds like him. Squeaky Johnny. You know he's a sneaky little character. Squeaky and sneaky. Oh, jeez. Squeaky and sneaky. Nicely done. In control. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. I thought I'd gone wrong then. Well, I should punch her out of the air. Ember to the outside. She's got nothing, so, uh, no influence on this match at the moment. Championship's either going to go to Raw with Ember. Or to smack down and remember we're going to have two new general managers now after how we started the show with Sami Zayn removed yeah. from his duties once and for all. Absolutely getting brutalised by Tech. Back in the ring. Candice, oh no she's going for Ember, I thought she might go back in the ring herself. Oh no she is going back in the oh, ring. Why would she put her back in the ring? Oh whoa whoa! Oh, Jesus! Whoa! Oh I didn't realise Dakota's turned over actually, that could have been a pin. That could have been, damn, that would have been something. If Ember Somebody, had lost like that. Somebody actually informed us the other day that in that Hill in the Cell match at Raw, I think when Kenny Omega is in the walls of Jericho, or it might have been Samoa Joe, he actually gets his arm over Joe, and it's a free count effectively. So maybe we really? might have had the wrong victor in that Hill in the Cell match, and oh the referee my God. didn't catch it. We need to check hopefully. the tape on that one. Yeah, none of their, hopefully none of them issues will present itself in this match, but it nearly did there, if Dakota was the it other did. way around. Imagine if Ember lost like that, she caused it herself. Oh Christ. Almost the worst thing for Ember here is if she doesn't get pinned to lose, that's just a wasted money in the bank cashing. That is true. And it could happen that now, is, because yeah. look at her, she's nowhere near. Out of the equation, full stop. She has banked a lot on that uh, money in the bank briefcase. Good God. She's, she might live to regret that. Well, she's not doing too bad. Health-wise, she's the best in the match. I think the incentive might have been decreased after uh, the Nia Jax loss for Ember Moon getting his championship because yeah. whoever wins it knows Nia Jax is in or up next for him. You've no got to imagine Nia it's Jax shaking the confidence of Moon as well. Yeah. I mean, God, these two well, pip swigs are easy for Ember Moon, but Nia Jax is a whole different kind of animal. Yeah, she is. We saw that uh, on Raw. But imagine if, say, Candice retains the championship. 
I think that's to me, Nia Jax. Yeah, Johnny will be Whooping out then. God. Yeah, he will. He'll Might play need a fight in a place. just to make it fair. Oh. Face breaker. Oh. This might be all over soon. Oh, hey. Hang on, she's taking herself out. How did she get knocked out? I do not know. I must have the... landed funny. Yeah, he must have hit the mat with the head, but I didn't see it. But I mean, God. That's not safe after the court was just a tap. Nice thinking by Dakota. Referee doing a good job there. Turn to the dark side, Dakota. That almost should have been a TKO where she knocked herself out. Although I don't think that applies in a triple threat match. There's a few boos directed at Dakota there. Not happy that she turned that. Oh. She was just, just going for the, the opportunity. Outside. Presented itself. No rules against she, it. Yep, yep. Well, yeah, it's triple Candice's threat match. Own fault that she took uh, herself out. Goes. I'm not surprised, but she'd be a bit annoyed if you lost because of yourself. <laughs> Into the corner. Oh, oh Ember's not looking there. Ember's not happy. God. She thought that was Candice she LeRae. Not. Jesus, using Candice as a weapon. All orchestrated by Dakota Kai, that, but now Dakota on the receiving end of Ember's punches. And oh, dear. Tombstone! <laughs> Whoa! Oh, but look who's back on her feet just before it uh, gets in for the pin. Already breaking get it up. Pinfall going. It's ruined it. Oh, my God. She's all over the place, the women's champion. She is. I'm not surprised she tried to knock herself Well, she didn't try to knock herself out. She did knock herself out earlier on. Ooh, nice combo. Back into her feet, though. Back into her feet. There we go. Getting back in the groove. Because Ember has to roll out again. What oh, the? dear. Oh, dear. Oh. Right to the head. Once again, back on her feet. Oh, Christ. Reverses it again. She is bringing the painful that moons, that summer slam on the ones that uh, mm -hmm. are not being cheered by the crowd here tonight. Oh, interesting choice. She did this from the uh, standing oh, position at last pay-per-view. That's what led to her losing the championship at the last pay-per-view from the standing position. She decided to knock her down into the seated position. Is it time? a little bit. Oh, mm -hmm. Straight out of that one. Ember that slides back. Look at Ember's health. Oh, oh God, God. still in the yellow. yellow bar. Have these rollouts been tactical by Ember? They might have strength been. Up. She might have been keeping one eye on the ring, knowing full well what's going on, whilst everyone else thinks she's knocked out. Look at this little double team. Oh, I had to turn eventually. As Candice rolls out to the outside, the cut oh, Christ, straight back to her feet. Got a special if they want to use it, whether it's a signature or a finisher. Ooh. Just got to pick the moment, got to pick the spot. Now's not turns a bad time around. for Dakota, whilst Candice is on the outside, but Ember Moon's <gasps> health. There she goes, for it. But look at the health of Jeez. Ember. Go! Oh, oh look he's back. Look back, back in here. Tried to break up the referee. He's not close. Oh, oh she kicked out. Yeah. She no kicked way near. out. Jesus. Straight onto Dakota right there. Suplex. And she rolls out from a suplex. Pathetic. Uh-oh. She's back. We know what she's going for. This is she Johnny's Johnny kick. Gargano. Can Ember duck it? Right across the ring. <gasps> Boom! No! She's only just received the chiropractor. Ooh. Hooks the leg once again. Three quarters of a red bar. Oh my god. Three oh. What the hell? Kicked out again? Yeah, look at Ember's health. God. That's two finishes and she's still not down to minutes. That is true. That is t oh god. Told you she's ready well, for this Dakota. championship. And she'll be ready for Nia Dakota Jax in the part two match. Time. She's already won it in my opinion, by the way, Ember Moon. I'll be well, don't forget this technically a get. rematch clause if one of them is to lose. Oh god. Dakota's going to break this break, up. But it's triple threat. Yeah. It is triple threat. Is that rematch? Oh my god, she fell off. What over. the hell's Dakota just done? What has she just oh done? Oh my god. What an idiot. She's fuming. She tripped over. Oh my, this is a botch fest of a match. Good god. Imagine a rematch clause Get and them that's off. what happens. Bring in Nia Jax for Jesus pain and destruction. Christ. Get what was that? He tried to break the referee or slap her on the head, but he wasn't having any of it. As if she missed that. Good God. Not even going to show it. Brilliant. It was embarrassing. Referee, oh go get a championship. We've got a championship. There's the title. Go get it, referee. Go get it. Oh, hello. Ooh. Hello. It's on. Well, this it's is the a match we should have had at SummerSlam. We should have given the title straight to Ember. And then we should have had this as a rematch. Good Oops, Lord, look at the size <laughs> difference. Jesus. That is going to be our Let's fight. Let's get the women's division kickstarted oh again. What? What? Hang on. So it's going down. Oh my it's god. happening. It's just darkness. And there's the fiend here. I don't like it. This, like the it's creepy. Division. this is the women's division. What is happening? 
Oh god, what's that? What's oh, that? that creepy thing! Oh, Sister Jesus! Sister Abigail! She's here! Yeah. Is she smiling? What the hell is that? God, can you call that smile? I do not know. Well, that was interesting. Right, well, forget about the old women's division. What the hell? Oh, he's wearing that as a trophy, isn't he? He beat the fiends at the last pay-per-view at Bash at the Beach. Is he wearing the mask as a trophy? Going Just forward, though, in against him. for the women's division, Naya versus Ember, which looks like it could be a classic for part two. And then the introduction of creepy little sister Abigail. Yeah, I don't know what that's about. It seems like tiny, at point she's confined to the house. She does look tiny. Hopefully she's mighty, but hey, Jax. Oof. She'll have a field day with her. She does anyway. have the uh, powers on her side, similar to what the Fiend and Matt Hardy have had in the past. Mm. They'll come into play, no doubt. Well, that's for another day with the women's division as we now go to the WWE Championship. As you said, Brody Lee mocking the Fiend there, wearing his mask as a trophy. And here is the champion. Remember, somebody's all must go, both undefeated. As Cody Rhodes is the current champion and puts his championship on the line tonight in part four. And I want to give this to Cody Rhodes because he's been so good as champion, but Brody Lee is just intimidating at the moment. He beat he's wearing it all match. At Bash at the Beach. He's wearing it. He's just mocking Bray Wyatt with that mask. Bray Wyatt is on the championship anymore. It's on. Someone is about to lose unless it's a draw. But I can't help. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> Imagine the anticlimactic. It's like the draw. small print. Oh my he's god, he busted, busted him open. Already. Jesus. We have to put that in the small print on the poster just in case people ask for refunds. Somebody's oh, must go. Unless it's a draw. Terms and conditions apply. <laughs> Jay, he's going after the head. That's why he's busting him open early on in the match. Yeah, Cody, oh, Cody, I think it might be your role that back. might be... I think we've got a new WWE champion here tonight. Oh! Good right, God. no one watches like we saw in the it's last match, guys. Like I want clean, cut fighting. Well, so far, so good. Cody Rhodes already in yellow head damage. That's not a good sign for him. This brother Lee has been targeting it. But he can. Jesus. Huge back body drop. But Cody keeps came back up to his feet. His forearms right to the face. Onto the ropes now. Yellow head damage already for Rhodes. Brody has just received a couple of odd punches as now he throws Cody into the corner. Oh Ugh. my god, working on the head again. The referee could not see that, obscuring the vision with the massive body of Brody Lee. Into the Achilles. Drags him down by the head. He's got a strategy here. here. He's got a block up, but I don't know if it's strong enough. I'm surprised the Dark Order out out here at ringside with him, to be fair. Yeah, but if you remember, they weren't there in the uh, Fiend match, and he got the job done. I was the Black oh losing God. tonight. We could have had that awkward situation, but he couldn't get the job done in the Battle Royale. Yeah, but uh, Brody braved a sigh of relief when he saw that. Obviously, he's uh, confident he's winning here tonight. But Cody Rhodes will not let him get away with it easily. Corner to corner now. Got the referee getting in the way again. Again, and going for that head. Cody tried to shake that one off, but it's not oh, working Christ. for him. Look at Brody's health. But look how slow Cody's moving as well. It's like they've already gone for Jesus. an hour. He has done oh, some man. damage initially. Already low on stamina as Cody into the barricade. That elbow Suicide right to the head down. instantly. God, knocking him for a six. Up against it. Yeah, he's definitely got a strategy here tonight. But he did the similar thing to the end. With a fiend at the end of his match, he went after the head. Preparing that discus clothesline. Hopefully he's a bit quicker with the discus clothesline tonight. He tried it about five times yeah. prior to hitting it against the fiend, but he just couldn't get revved up. He did. All those reversals. I believe Matt Riddle as well had a couple to say against him. God, in one of the warm-up matches. I always think he needs Matt. to mix it up, Brody. Bring in a more JBL kind of clothesline. I, I, think so. I think he gets so much power on that turn. That spin, that's what sets up his power. He just needs to go for it in uh, wiser situations. Look at the state of Cody Rhodes. Are we even three minutes into this match? 
Red head damage, know, orange body damage, no health, low on stamina. At least he's got a couple of finishers, but what good are they going to do when Brody has nearly got a full green bar still? I know, it's slightly uh, alarmed. Oh my god, he managed to turn it back around. He's getting some strikes in here, Cody. Not Red many, body damage now. What the heck's wrong with Cody? Jesus. Well, he's running to Brody Lee's. What's happened? I can't quite see from this angle, obviously, but I think the, the uh, blood's starting to run down the forehead of Cody. So it must just be above his Cody hairline. Cody at the, the minute cut. is reminding me of a boxer who has been protected his entire career just to keep his undefeated record. Well, you could say that. Although he did go through a grueling triple threat match with Daniel Bryan and Apollo Crews at one point, and he managed to come out with a championship. Yeah. He's had some difficult fights. This is, although it's not working for age difference, but effectively Brody Lee is the new up-and-coming heavyweight and he's knocking everybody oh out and Cody's done everything he can to avoid him but tonight he had to take that fight and he's hitting him with every shot he's got and it's just not going to be good enough this is yeah told you it does seem like a uh, good analogy that for this match barely a one count I know embarrassing for Cody on the shoulders of Brody where's he taking him here try to put him in the corner he's struggling here what's he doing God, oh God damn it, Cody fighting up against him. Must have kept his foot on the rope, he's not pushing him away. Didn't go for I'm a finish, so that's not reversed. Oh, going in for, oh, the I hell? Going for a uh, figure four for a second. Not the case. It's, it's the knee of Brody. Brody, look at him. Out of he's gas. He's grinding the health down though, slowly now. Oh my God, he went for another crossroads. Nothing left in the tank. Oh, see, he uh, needs to work uh, on the oh cardio. God. They elbows back and forth to each other. Oh, oh looking for a vintage he's just chop fell block over. there. Into the corner, he throws him. Can he's he even run? Now. Oh, my word. Cody, bouncing he's out so the corner. Lethargic. Good God, he just can't get a move in. He's struggling to breathe at the minute, though, Brody Lee as well at the same time. Look at that stamina. Yeah, he's uh, having to go quite relentlessly to keep Cody off his feet. Oh, oh dear. And that is perfect. Oh dear. Cody can catch him off guard here. I don't think it'll be enough as... Yeah. Oh, oh man, it's turned very wrong for Cody Rhodes. <gasps> Whoa, that was close. God. That was close. Cody Did you see how quick he got it? up in the panic? He's got to come back, Cody, and he needs to use it right now. What's Brody doing? What is he doing? What what is I he thought doing? Cody reversed that, but he hasn't. Oh, God, what's he doing? I don't know. What's this? I do not know. Got a huge punch to the back. Jesus. Oh, actually, I think I know what he's going for. This is, is a big. It? This is a big move for a big man. Dark red head Jesus damage. Christ. No wonder. Did you see what he just did to him? Not surprised. Big in elbows. Good God. This is too big. Oh, he made Frankensteiner from the top rope. Jesus, bringing out all the stops against Cody. He didn't even need to do that to beat Cody Rhodes. I don't believe. What? Oh my God, the comeback. What the hell? A bit of a nightmare. Just the ad and away he goes. The adrenaline flowing. Just drops a knee on his face. I just don't think Roddy Rhodes is devastated enough to win the WWE Championship back here tonight, or retain it at least for Cody. Do you really? Well, see we saw what he did against falling? the Fiend. Yeah. We hit three in succession against the Fiend, and quite a lot of his opponents, to be honest with you. Seems to be his go-to. Maybe he uh, doubts his own finish. DDT, nicely delivered. He's starting to whittle Brody down, but it's just oh, there we go. That's busted him open. Finally. Bit of blood for Brody as well. Enough. The know damage has been done to all. Cody though with the dark red head damage. It has. But well, he's going for that head. He's fighting smart here tonight. Once again going for the head. He, he might have gone for that to get any worse. Time. Especially, has he, he hasn't even received a discus clothesline yet, has he? He hasn't. No, he hasn't received a discus. So that, that might be one and done. Probably. God, punches Especially that Brody's thing. got one stored. He has, where's he? I thought he was going for a weapon then. Oh, he's sort of going for a weapon, indirectly. So how many times are we going to have to put these tables back together tonight? No, no, at least we got the spot of the night though with it. We did. Matt Riddle absolutely been flown off a ladder. What the heck is Brody going to do for this table? Surely it'd work better God for knows. Cody Rhodes if Cody could find a reversal. He ain't going to find a reversal. It's more punishment for do? Cody. Oh, I bet it's a, it's a power bomb. Yeah, oh, the there we sit go. out there power bomb. He's going, for. He's going to be on yeah. the edge. Oh, God. We saw him do the deadlift uh, power bomb earlier on. That's been uh, his repertoire. Cody Rhodes is in a world of pain right now. Back in the this ring. This is the awesome. The crowd don't care about the status of Cody Rhodes. They're just happy to see a table being broken 
one with Rhodes' body. I want to feel at this point, Brody's starting to toy with Cody Rhodes, potentially maybe injuring him? Yeah, it's uh, becoming about 70-30 in favour of Brody here. This okay. is a bad Just showing for Cody right at SummerSlam. I mean, it's not any worse than what we saw in the last match, but uh, this is not one for the DVD of Cody Rhodes to look back on and watch. No, it is not. Yet. We all know it can change in an instant. It can. It can. If he just hits a sneaky roll-up, that's the job done. We've seen that happen before. Second reversal. Hasn't Again, found it. A big Super move to Cody. Pin. Delivered. He is definitely time with him at this point. Just finish it, Brody. Okay. God, we don't need to put him through anymore. He does, fight apparently. Oh. oh. Face first. Ooh. Nicely done. Oh god, what's oh, happening now? He doesn't now? need this. That's oh, the fiend. God. Well, he isn't the fiend anymore. Actually, it's Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt in that because they had a match on SmackDown. Than usual. Decides not to get involved fully, but Cody Rhodes is distracted. Wait, why is he gone after Cody Rhodes and not the man who defeated him, Brody Lee? Mm, you're creepy. But oh, oh god. big boot! Imagine that Bray lurking Wyatt. behind you. Nearly having to catch Cody there, he went flying. God, Just purple end head it. damage. Just end he it. He stood up again. What oh the hell? Word. Purple head damage now for Cody. As Brody refuses to hit the discus clothesline. He's just enjoying himself too much. God, dropping that knee again on the head. What's happening now? What the hell is that? Is it? Hang on. Why? That's Sami Zayn's car. That's Sami oh Zayn's God. car. At least the fire department. Why is his car on fire? The fire department's here to what? save it. Oh, he's given. The... Why is he giving up? He's just leaving. It's too late. He can't save it. Why is Sami Zayn's car on fire? I don't know. <gasps> I mean, double kicks avoided. Uh, okay. Damn, that's uh, unfortunate for Sami here tonight. What the hell? Who's burning his car? Hang on, I'm just getting told eyewitness reports describe suspects similar to Kane and Jinder Mahal. They seem to matter. That little weird team going after oh. Sami Zayn for some reason. What the? Why they? Oh. Imagine I'm just setting his car on fire in parking lot. A bit much after he lost his job tonight as well. It was actually. That's yeah. Yeah, he's having a Great bad night. Great damage, by the way, for Cody. Oh, what's Brody arguing with the referee for? Look at like Cody's you were body telling on the him floor. to get the free count because he's setting up for the discus clothesline. Cody getting up to his feet though. The hell? He hasn't finished yet. Jesus, calm down. He'll oh, be crap. kicking himself. He's an opening. He somehow loses this <laughs> Olympic slam. Shades of angle right there. Damn right, you're going to go in for a pin. I don't think it'll be enough for Brody. No, nope. not Still even nearly. Not even close. Come on, Cody. 11% off that signature, but Brody with a finisher that can be hit. Oh, making mistakes. Anytime he wants, but he keeps on refusing it. Into the middle of the ring. Oh, this is a Moon nice move. Soul. Look at that. Picture perfect. He still hasn't got Brody in any red damage, though, yet, Cody. He hasn't. That's how one sided Pathetic. this one's been. I thought he could have turned that around. He didn't. He's getting his moves in now. At least there's something there. Goes in for a. P Ooh. <sighs> Starting to show weakness. I think it might angry, be time to wrap it right up, now. Brody. Here we go. Finding the groove. Crossroad. Oh my god, don't end like this, for the love of god. <gasps> that be the worst this bit of kick. Oh, beautiful. Good god. He saw the danger. Oh, spider the senses were tingling. And he hit the drop kick to avoid the discus clothesline. I don't think we've seen that before. So I told you, really you he needs a JBL version. It. He needs the clothesline from he hell. Might do. Too he slow might do. on the rotation. Oh, he needs to drag him up from a uh, unconscious position and blast him with it. Unless oh, he can get that spin like a Beyblade, there is no point for Brody Lee to hit that discus. Back in. Oh, no, he's not going back in the ring. One more shot on the head just for good measure. Oh, actually, his chest is safe ish. Cody's down. Oh, this might be right, it. Cody finish is it. down. You've got him, Brody. He's going for it. He's going for it. The God, discus pull him down, pull him out of his misery. Cody oh. Rhodes has lost. Jeez. He's going oh, for another one. Word. He's doing Don't Cody's own it. strategy. 
This is Cody's own strategy. Multiple finishers in a row. Oh, go on. And that God. is done. We've got a new oh, spins him around. Oh, oh my no. God. He is not kicking out of that. No done. way has he won like that. Oh my God. I mean, why would he put doubt in out anyway? Mind? Gee, he was making sure that That's he was an illegal that move. Here tonight. The referee did not stop it. The referee did not see it. Smackdown, is on. Smackdown Road doesn't have a general on. manager to enforce those rules. Why would he do that? I don't know. He could have just been normally and he'd have got the match. Well, why would he cast doubt in everyone's mind? He's just giving Cody a reason to get back at him. Mm, I don't know about that. Cody Rhodes isn't going to come anywhere in that championship in the immediate future if he knows what's good for him. That shows Neither doubt will the referee get away. In the mind of Brody Lee that he couldn't have won. Without a bit of cheating going on there, Cody Rhodes may have just got in the mind of Brody Lee, but nevertheless, we have got a new WWE Champion as we end part four of SummerSlam. Up next, the Tag Team Championship match and the World Heavyweight Championship. Will Tech cash in? Tune in to find out.